Hi guys. Running a little bit later than normal on this Saturday evening. How are you guys today? Um, you can see I'm surrounded by a lot of new blooms on the wall and luckily, well, maybe it depends on how you look at it. Um, that's my newest art series and I do have a couple more available on the turquoiseiris.com, but I think most of them are sold, but there are two. Actually, that one right there in the back ground is still available. Was that her? How are you guys? Happy Saturday. Yes, Matt's here too. We Hello. had the opportunity. Um, we were running late. I apologize, but I'm going to get started on this side right here because we've done the front, we've done the side, and we need to do this side here. I will have to do the top, but that's going to be like not on camera steps. Opportunity to go to a surprise party for my son's girlfriend. She turned 18 and it was uh, the most beautiful party I think I've ever been to with the most beautiful display and um, totally a surprise. My son was in charge of keeping her away and he got to bring her in today. And so that's where we were. We hung out and uh, finally decided to cut out. And so that's why we're running a little late. So for those of you, you are watching the metallic tutorial. Oh, good. Um, I'm going to go and grab the same colors that we've been working with. Mermaid tail and water lily. And I've got them right here. And we'll start again, once again, for our part four or is this three. part three? Three. Uh, it's part four. Three. Come on, design assistant. It's part four. And a half. Three four and, and a half. half. I don't know. And so then, um, once we get the sides done and we get everything up to the same speed, hi, bub, um, then we'll start working on the, the finishing off the touches of this. I, you know, Matt had suggested a feather to create like a marble effect, and then several other people commented and said, maybe you could do like a feather, and you know how you kind of twist it and kind of give like a, a vein? Uh, anyway, it's a, it's, a, it's a possibility. So, um, hello guys, I'm so glad you're here. Like I said, I'm sorry we're a little late. Let's dive right into doing more of that crosshatch pattern that we were doing with the two blues. Anybody know the name of this? Don't answer. You probably don't know. You know, don't you? I want to see if anybody else knows. Ah, okay. So who knows the name of this brush? Um, hello. Hello. You guys, I just want to say thank you so much for the response on the, they said VIP, uh, the response on this series and then also the response on my purses. I've had such great response. I've actually, um, you guys have already got me thinking about my next designs and my next series and that's always fun when I get to start planning the next thing. The wide mouth brush. No, bub, it's the VIP. Keep up. When you guys hear me say bub, that's actually my brother and uh, he likes to get on here on YouTube and say silly things and maybe Pretty much everybody got it right except for your brother. Everybody got it right except for Lance. Yeah. That sounds about right. Uh, Jessica Smith, she says, ooh, I have a really cool technique. Ooh. You might want to try. Okay. You need to take one of your paintbrushes okay. to a long stick. It okay. creates a really cool surprising organic line. Does that make sense? Yeah. So you tape it to like a long stick and then you try to control it. And then you try to control it and it just kind of does it. Of course, you wouldn't want this brush. You would want like a smaller brush. Right, Jessica? You should do a purse with your bride, lady. Oh, that's a good idea. The, the painting with the bride on it, I should put that on a purse. That's a good idea. Uh, Claudette Van. Hi, Claudette. It's 5.20 a.m. in South Africa. Well, thanks Ooh. for joining. Welcome. Yeah, Jessica said, like, yeah, you tape it to a stick. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Thank what you for you that. You need to try that, figure that out. That sounds like a good project for me because then I can get a stick and I can paint from way over here. Yeah, you could just sit there I in your chair a, across the room. I could. I could get, like, a, like a six-foot stick <laughs> and I could paint. Does your brother have one of your paintings or a piece of furniture? Karen Brown, he has um, a piece of furniture of mine in their dining room. And do they have a painting of mine? Facebook just interrupted. Hmm. 
I don't know if they have a painting of mine. Lance, do you have a painting of mine? I, they probably do. Oh, yes, they do. Yes, they do. I remember Lance bought one for Shelly for her birthday one year. Yeah, Shelly, Shelly's like me. She loves a lot of color, and so she and I get along real well as far as like when we're decorating. Yeah, we like a lot of the same things. Um, it says that Facebook froze for a minute. Yeah. But I think it's good now. Just refreshing and working, but it keeps interrupting. Because you got plenty of power to the, to the devices there. Yep, I do. I charged them all day. We're good to go. You know, after 90 days, you get into a nice little rhythm, and I'm like, charge the phones, everything's in a nice little rhythm. We're just a little bit later tonight because we had that surprise birthday party, and it was really hard for me to leave because it was good music. Well, we've got quite a few people joining. And they, uh, Facebook is start freezing up, so sorry about that, guys. They had a photo booth. Uh, Mandy Driscoll, it's Australia Day here, same as our Independence Day. Really? Well, happy Australia Day. Are you getting any relief at all today? Now I'm gonna switch hands, switch colors. Uh, Tony Ron Wilson, would you like, like to know the colors you're using? Okay, so the lighter periwinkle color is Water Lily, and these are colors from DIY Paint. It's like a periwinkle, and then I have mermaid tail, which is a dark turquoise. Absolutely beautiful colors. And I've never used these two together like this before. This was the first time that I've put them on like this in this pattern, as well as together in a combination. I planned on this being my base coat, and I was gonna basically paint over the whole thing and just let these colors peek out, but then it turned out really pretty. And it was one of those things that was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. Um, I don't think we should cover this up. So in a moment, I will add some Golden Ticket. I will add um, some Hay Sailor, which is our navy. I will add a roller technique, and it's going to give it lots of fun texture. Do we need to come down a little bit? Um, I think that I will work on the top part first before we go down. Because... Got a lot of people hopping on, honey. Saying Hi, guys. hello. Hi, guys. I hope you had a great day. Mary on. Val's on. Uh... What did we do all day today, Matt? Gary, uh, Gail Barry's on. Hi, Gail. What did we do all day, Matt? I wrapped presents all day. You wrapped presents. He wrapped purses and paintings and built frames. And uh, he was busy, busy, busy. And uh, such a huge help to me, guys. There's no way I could do all of this without this guy right here. We have a question from Jasmine Smith. She had a question. Okay. She says, I've been meaning to ask, are you a partner in the DIY paint company? I am not a partner. I, um, I do not own. Um, DIY is owned by Debbie Beard. I am not a business partner as far as I, the traditional sense of what it is. I just love the company and I love the paint and I love her and so I'm just all in you know what I mean you just get along I do with take her? I do take ownership over it like mentally in my mind so that's why that's why you would think that uh Claudia Moon Powell where do you where do you buy your brushes I buy my brushes from paintpixie.com Paint Pixie. I use all brushes from Paint Pixie, another wonderful company and another wonderful brand that I support. Um, I am a retailer for both Paint Pixie and DIY Paint. So um, you can actually get it from the store in, in, in uh, Moore, where I sell Paint Pixie brushes, DIY Paint, and I also have some IOD transfers and um, some stamps there too. So um, love those companies so much. Mandy Driscoll said they finally got some rain after none for 12 months. I am so glad you got, I remember you got some rain the other day, like a couple of days ago. And then I know there was a little bit more on the forecast. Um, I also heard that it wasn't really set, it wasn't soaking in. And so it was kind of just running off and, oh. I mean, <laughs> what? Your brother. He's he bored? He, he said Matt is a great assistant to the regional manager. <laughs> the office reference to the office. Oh, 
the, the office show? Yes. Okay, now I'm going to add some golden ticket, you guys. Uh, Lewis Avery, or Lois, excuse me. Uh, are the wide brushes also paint pixie? Yes, they are. They're called the VIP. They're actually part of the Turquoise Iris collection. So I have um, some brushes that I actually private label. They private label for me. And so the VIPs actually are from the Turquoise Iris. And then we also have a magic pack and we have the team, which are more of an, the art, art brushes. So I'm letting this gold set up for just a second. That way it doesn't, as soon as I spray it with water, it doesn't just all drip and run. So I'm letting it kind of set up for a minute dry a little bit, and then I'm going to hit it with some water. Uh, Wendy Moore, is the dresser next to your next creative uh, creation? So the one next to me is the one that I started working on today in my Creative Connection. We do a monthly tutorial, and the last week of the month, I work on a piece for them exclusively. So I don't do it in, on this page, but I always produce something, uh, some sort of paint tutorial for them as part of their membership. Okay, so that, and then. Water? Um, hang on, I am like, I'm missing something. I'm missing We're missing something. the music. I what am I missing? We can't have music, but what am I missing? The water girl brush? No, what? Oh, the roller. Where's roller. the roller? It's behind me. That's what it was. Okay. Jasmine Smith said she watched the FNL first time last night. She really enjoyed it. Can't wait for the next one. Oh, thank you so much for watching. It's quite, it's quite, uh, it's quite a riot. It's, it was different last night, Matt. You missed it because uh, Anissa was on. And for those of you on YouTube, every Friday night I do a Friday, and it's called Friday Night Live. And I've been painting live on Fridays. And that was the only day of the week originally where I was going live and painting. But, as you all know, I've started doing just about every day. And some days I'm on three or four times in my closed groups. But, last night we added a third person to the mix. And we're painting and doing a... We're painting on canvases, we're mailing it to the next one, and we're doing like a, th like a, a trio series. It's like a traveling paint series. There it is, traveling paint series. Remember like the traveling pants, it's traveling paints. I... Get it? Like it. Did you get it? I, I got it. Okay. Liz. I got uh, it. question. Lisa Dixon. Hi. I ordered, <clears throat> I ordered the DIY brush cleaner, and when I opened it, I had no idea how to use it. LOL. Instructions? Question mark. What do you mean? I, hold on, guys. I can't find my putty knife. I can't move on without my putty knife. Do you see it? I have to apply the navy that way. Uh, I'll find it. Well, it's not on my hook. It's, would, it be, would it be in the kitchen sink? No. I would never wash it. What about the bathroom sink? Yeah. It should be right here in this room. In a drawer? The putty knife. The one I've had for years. I've never washed it. You should take it outside? No. I don't know, babe. Well, no, I can't, I I can't move on without it. Do I need to look for it? This is good TV right here. No, it's terrible. This is excellent TV. <sighs> it's terrible. Just tell me it's where the last place It's got to be... Um, I used it last night right here. Did you not use it today? I used it last night right here on the canvases. I did not use it today. Good TV. <laughs> well... I apply the navy with a putty knife, and it's got to be, um, I guess I'll use a different kind of putty knife, which would hurt my feelings. Oh gosh, that's terrible. Make you guys wait like that. Guys, I'm sorry. We're off our game. We started a little late because we went to a surprise birthday party, and the music was too good, and I didn't want to leave. True story. Oh, gosh. Oh, now you're really off your game yeah, now. Yeah, I am totally off now. Like, now I'm like, okay, good night. Like, this is going to give it a totally different texture. Oh, 
got to find the putty knife. I've been using that same one for like five years and it was already 10 years old at least. I'm sure it's on the floor somewhere. It better be. I know last night I used it when I was um, painting with Anissa and Q. Like I, I had the canvas. Is that it? No. Oh wait, is that, it's there. I see it. Other, other thing. You're welcome. Matt, save the day. I don't know why you didn't see it earlier. You're welcome. You're welcome YouTube and Facebook. She's about to have a breakdown. You're gonna see her have a breakdown. <laughs> I wasn't gonna have a breakdown, I might cry. Is that a breakdown? That's a breakdown. That's kind of normal. Okay, here we go, here we go. <laughs> uh, Anna May Fuller, she said, Matt, pay attention. <laughs> I know, it's my fault, I know. I should have known where it was at. That was a bad assistant on my part. <laughs> I'm like, stop the show, hang on, where's my putty knife? I travel with this, I bring it everywhere, to every class that I go to, I bring it with me. Yes, yes, Cindy, Connor, it is the assistant's job to keep track of equipment. Yes, I agree. <laughs> 100%. I knew how somehow this was going to turn into my fault. <laughs> That's okay, though. I'm used to it. Yeah, you should be. Pretty used to it, huh? Alice joined us today. Hi, Alice. I know I'm on the feeling time. better? Anybody have any questions you would like to ask? Did my video go out? No. Nope. You on. didn't get my video out? When? When would I have done that oh today? Oh my goodness, see, you made my fans, you made oh me look gosh. like a gosh, when would I have oh done goodness. that today? No, guys, I'm sorry. I literally worked all day. He worked all day. We just took a break to go to that surprise birthday party, and we're back at it. And I will probably work again for several more hours trying to do it. Anyway, I put together a fabulous, I mean, probably award-winning... Probably Oscars. Okay, Woods. I mean, it's possible. Take it easy. Um, documentary. Documentary. Yeah, it's a documentary about furniture. Oh my gosh. So it's it's up for some it's up for some awards and it hadn't even it's not even out yet. Really? Yeah, it's up for awards. So oh whenever gosh. Dion can can upload it to the on the line. You should learn how to upload it. <laughs> Just saying. It's too it's too complicated. Okay, I've got this perfect. It's looking like the front now that we found the spatula. And um, now let's move the camera down just a smidge, baby. Matthew Woods. Let's, ready? All right. Yeah, please. Please, pretty please. Do you think anybody believes you? I think everybody's highly... It's pretty much going to be the high, most highly anticipated documentary. You know what? You can tell you watch a lot of movies. You need to come down lower. I know. Just okay. give, me, give me a sec there, princess. Okay. So. How's that? That's great. Thank you. Okay, guys. Let's get the rest of this going. And tomorrow I'm really excited about putting some final touches on the front. I want to go back to the front, but we had to get the sides. Y'all laugh, don't laugh and encourage him. It's so shiny. Okay, that's better. It was really shiny. It's like a child. Don't encourage it. Don't encourage that behavior. <laughs> How do I view Friday Night Live from last night? I was busy. You just go back to the Turquoise Iris and you um, go to videos or really I've only posted a few times today you can just scroll back on Facebook and you can view last night's video it's right there they're all there they're there from 2015 they're all there you uh, can get the long brush you can order it from the paintpixie.com 
or after this video, I always post all of my affiliate links that you can use to order. And I would love if you would use my affiliate link. I actually get a little credit for that and it makes, um, I use it towards my orders for my brushes. But well, we are working on another video, aren't we, honey? We are working on a new video, you guys. It's gonna be fabulous. It's pretty much gonna be an award-winning. Okay, Woods. But it's not really a documentary. As it is. Can you just tell them? No, I, I want the you anticipation to build. <laughs> so dramatic. Let's just put it this way. I know it's going to break the internet. I'm in it a lot. You are so it's gonna break it. yourself it's, tonight. We're going to break, break the internet. You're welcome, Deb. You're welcome. I am sure your video will be awesome. Thank you. No, we, um, we wanted to do like one kind of I don't know we'll just wait and show you but no Matt put together a, a video showing you guys how to repair furniture several people have asked and so the other day while I was working he he had to fix the front of this piece for me and so he went ahead and recorded himself it's real it's short and to the point and he just was showing you guys how to fix a piece of furniture so um, I, yes yes so I will for the next uh, furniture documentary I will be uh, doing how to build uh, easy custom frames for canvas. So that is in the works as well. That's not what I'm really referring to on our, our next big one, but I will be putting one out. So just, it's real super easy, simple way to spruce up the canvases, right honey? Sure, babe. I didn't know you were going to do that. Yeah, my fans are calling for it, so I thought I should follow through, you know. Thanks for the playful personality on here. You're welcome. You're always going to get playful around here. <laughs> Casey and Stacy Watley says, Matt, Casey painted with me tonight. It was only a sign for our business, but he did paint. There you nice. go. Well, Matt's going to paint next week for us, you guys. Next Saturday, or whatever night is the first. What day is the first on for, for us? That's the night you're going to paint with me, honey. Right? Yes, that's when that's when we're gonna have a black and white uh, paint off. Um, as far they, I mean, there's a lot of buzz right now on the line, honey. About what, baby? About when you're gonna be able to get that video uploaded. <laughs> uh, Martin Ro Martin Rook, um, the dance moves. Will not be in this one we released tonight, but it's highly possible they will make their way into the next next couple videos. So yeah, probably so. Be be looking set set the, the bells right. Did I say that right? Set the bells and the timers for the deans. Oh yes, yes. yes. Turn on your notifications yeah. for that one. Mhm, 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 mhm. Okay, guys. Now. Oh, thank you, Jasmine. Golden ticket. She says, it's been a rough week. Thanks for lifting my spirits and getting oh. me through the rough week. You are amazing and so refreshing to see such genuine people online. Appreciate you. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much for that. You are so thoughtful. And yes, just love a humble man. That's right. <laughs> I just love a humble man. I don't really talk ever until the camera gets on me. It, then I just open no, up. No, you talk when the camera's not on. <laughs> They're just not familiar with you. But mm. now they are. Someone's always teasing somebody in our family. That's another thing. One of these boys, and it's usually me. It's usually mama. Someone's picking on mama all the time. And I'm cool with it. They always say you pick on people you love, right? Right, Woods? Yes. 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 I'm cool with it. Now that looks like a hot mess right now, doesn't it? Uh, we got some trees happening now. I think uh, Wendy Moore, who else can see the shadows of the trees? I think I see what you're talking about, Wendy. Are they, are Wendy, are, are the trees you seeing, are they on a slope? Do you see that, Wendy? What? Are you seeing things in my or painting? Or Lisa, Lisa Dixon also sees them. Yes, Jasmine Smith can see them. You see things in my painting? Uh, Wendy said yes, so yes. 
There, you have trees now. We have no scary faces, which is good. Trees are nice. I like trees. I like trees, but they're, I mean, are they up here or something? They're right where your hand is. Right there? Right there. Ah, gotcha. So I'm going to throw this idea out at you guys because um, Facebook has given, or not Facebook, YouTube has given me now the option of creating my own members that nobody else gets so you get perks and you get badges and you get um, special content and so I'm curious of those of you that are on here if that is something that you guys would be interested in um, a monthly a monthly subscription of a membership for YouTube I already have a membership group on Facebook which this would be something a little little totally different uh, Claudia Moon Powell says, uh, says, oh yes, uh, I got, got that too, Dion. Uh, Gary, get, excuse me, Gail Seaman, I see a golden dandelion. Nice. Oh, I love golden dandelions. Uh, Jasmine, I can't get a roller yet, so I'm think, I think I'm going to wrap a roller with twine and roll it over my paint or okay. string. Okay. That's a great idea. I've seen that work really well. It's a good texture. Rubber bands work too. Some small rubber bands around it. Okay. Yeah, I think you see the dandelions too. I don't really quite see the dandelion. Maybe because I don't know what a dandelion looks like. <laughs> I think no, I No, it's a weed. Like, they grow in our yard. Oh, they grow in yeah, our yeah, yard. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I know, I know what that is. Yeah. The boys used to pick them and hand them to me. So have you decided what more you're going to do to this, what you get all the sides done? Well, I'm really excited about adding in white and dark wax, actually, for the front. Um, but I'm probably going to go ahead and try the feather idea first. I just have to come up with which color I want. So if I can create a vein with a feather in it, I think that's what I want to do. I was talking about the harassment yeah, family, family. Mm -hmm. Claudia. Right. Because she gets that as well, I'm assuming. <laughs> yeah, it is pretty loud around up in here, that, that harassment from, from the three guys that live here. Uh, Jim Hogan got my water bottle yesterday. Girl Upcycle. Oh, good. Nice. Good deal. So you've got a water girl. That's wonderful. You can make, you can make wine with dandelions? A good herb, good herb. I didn't know that, Glenda. You You're really? so smart. I, oh, Glenda would know, trust me. Oh, I, I'm not doubting what she's saying. Yeah. I was just like, wow, never she heard would that know. before. Okay, so I have to kind of let this go. It's got lots of water on it. We have um, three shades of blue and golden ticket. We have the roller here. So what I have to do is, I think we could turn it around the front to shiver. Remind people what the front looks like, and then we'll talk about I mean, what we're going to do. It's going to be hard because it's wet. Oh. Okay. Okay. Well, then we're going to have to stop right there then. Um, what we're going to do tomorrow, guys, we're going to go back to the front, and um, I have to decide if I want to create a little vine, a vein, excuse me, with a feather because, oh, the dry brush cleaner. Oh, okay. Hey, hang on. Glad she said something. Okay, so this is a brand new one. This is what you get from DIY. She's you said you said you ordered one from DIY, right? Okay, so see this mesh thing right here? This is what scrubs your brush, Lisa. It's a brush scrubber. So you put it in there, you get it wet, and you literally use this to scrub your brush and get the soap and everything in there. The soap, God, that smells great. The soap is inside there. You scrub your brush, and then you just rinse it out underneath the faucet, like that. 
So it's in there and it's permanent. They built it in there and handy dandy scrubber is already in there. And then dump that, let it dry and then put the lid back on. Patricia Welch, thank you so much. Um, I really am excited for you to see. And oh, thank you so much, Billy. Um, I, I was curious if anybody on YouTube would be interested. You're, well, you're welcome, Lisa. I was interested if anybody would be interested in the subscription or the membership group. It would like start at like five. There would be a couple of levels, $5, but we would be providing extra content for those that were in the, the YouTube group. So just a thought. Good night, everybody. I want you to know oh, that tomorrow I, 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 we have questions. Yeah, you need to ask me you Well, somebody, Alice said good night, so I was just saying good night to mm -hmm. her. Um, uh, Lo uh, Lois Lavery. Yeah. Do you plan? Do you begin painting with the design in mind, or does it evolve as you work? It evolves as I work. This was not the plan for this. What I thought was, I'm going to um, use these two colors of blue, and that's as far as I got. I was putting it on the base coat, and then when I started doing the crosshatch pattern with these two colors. It started looking really good. You guys started saying really nice things, and I thought, wait a minute, maybe that's not what we're doing just yet. Then I added in Golden Ticket and the Hey Sailor, which was a dark blue, and you guys started saying it looked like rock from and stone. Some of you said a geode, agate, all of those. Um, well, hello with her toy. Oh, my goodness. Did you bring Mama Daddy your toy? <laughs> okay. Okay, she brought me this right now. So anyway, this is available for somebody that doesn't necessarily feel like they can paint a marble look. They can actually buy this stamp from Iron Orchid Designs. So a lot of you said it looked like marble and stone. And so I want to started rolling with that and decided this was not actually going to be the main color instead of the base coat. So thank you guys for your positivity. And you can get DIY paints. You can go to any of our 300 retailers across the US and Canada, or if you want to and you'd rather order it, I will post a link here just as soon as we get finished. I have an affiliate link. And if you order from my affiliate link, actually get a little credit. So that would be great. And then they'll ship it right to your door. Yep, that's Abby girl. You guys, thank you so much. Does anybody have any more questions or feedback about the subscription to the YouTube channel? Uh, if not, I'm going to sign off. Matt will sign off. It's a little bit late, I know. And um, it's time for hot tea and figs. <laughs> Does that sound like a crazy are, Saturday night? We are partying it Woo! up right here. Well, that's how we do it. Every <laughs> night I get off of here, hot tea and figs. It used to be a brownie, but it's turned to hot tea and figs. Um, awesome, you guys. Take care and have a wonderful, wonderful night and Sunday morning. And I'll be back same place, same time right here. See you. See you later.